Hello everybody, I'm going to show you how to do a read receipt. So if you're using Gmail, you might want to use a read receipt. We're doing all this e-learning and this is a good way to make sure that your students or your staff check their email. Uh, this is also a way that it helps me take attendance. So what I do is I just fill out um, in the two or the carbon copy all of my students email addresses you know I've got them all grouped so I just copy and paste them into there you cannot do this if you blind carbon copy students so then what we do is you know I put a good subject whether it's you know the e-learning and the date or whatever subject you have or your agenda and then I write uh, in the subject or I'm sorry in the text box you know what's gonna happen for the day the expectations on what assignments need to get done um, the order of them and things like that then you go down here to these three dots and you hit this very important thing that says request read receipt so if you ever are questioning whether or not you clicked it you can click it again and see that the check mark is there that means that you're gonna get a read receipt from your students um, if they follow this along a quick heads up if your students are checking their email on like their their devices their phones um, I teach my students to um, send me like a reply with you know the thumbs up emoji okay emoji everything's good um, kind of thing uh, just to make sure that they got it, um, it because Gmail on some devices don't send send receipts so a lot of times in this time of e-learning I also hit this down arrow and schedule an email to go out in the morning and usually it's about eight o'clock we start school around nine o'clock believe it or not my high school students don't check their email first thing in the morning but also I don't think they're waking up at eight o'clock either um, so I'm not gonna hit that right now because this is a practice email and I'm sending it to myself so I'm gonna hit send send there we go all right so it just popped up in my inbox and when a student gets their email they're gonna read it and be like oh great my teachers love me they just sent me an email of everything I have to do for the day you know make it make it nice to them right and then they need to hit this back arrow right here when they hit the back arrow this will pop up and it'll be like hey do you want to send or send receipt not now or send a receipt I taught my students hit that send receipt make sure that I get it I know you read it and so let me quickly go back and show you what it looks like on a teacher's point of view so here's an email that I sent to my students on the 17th and I scroll down and then I hit this plus button and it's really hard to see but there's a plus button right here and you can see all of my students when they checked it if you've got a couple Christians in the class you can always hit this show detail it'll show you who read it when they read it and all that good stuff so sending a send receipt is a great way to make sure your students are checking their email make sure your staff is checking their email uh, and it's also um, a great way to just stay in contact with everybody all right I hope this was helpful if you have any more questions, feel free to comment below and I'll get back to you. Good luck and stay safe.